Uh, when Rever first started, we were, you know, there weren't that many video sharing sites. Uh, since then, uh, there are probably about 150 video sharing sites in the marketplace. And I think that they're all kind of chasing uh, YouTube right now. Uh, Rever is really not about chasing YouTube or any other kind of vertical portal, uh, kind of, you know, place where you go and watch videos. What we're focused on is enabling uh, a new form of creator uh, to create both their own websites, to create a sharing mechanism, to create a monetization mechanism, uh, you know, a way to be discovered, a way to integrate into search engines and have their content discovered. Uh, and so what we saw is, is that while there are 150 different video sharing sites with kind of the same idea of they don't really know what their business model is yet, but they're going to gather eyeballs, we have said, okay, well, eventually they're going to need a business model. So Rever seems to be a great business model that's working and that's been, uh, you know, I think respected by people. It's a clean network. It's, it's work, you know, it's monetizing content right now. Um, people for the first time are getting paid for their works online. Um, and so what we did is we said uh, about nine months ago, we said, you know what, we should open up the system completely and allow other video sharing sites to use Rever. So uh, in the next couple of weeks, you'll see that our API, which has been, you know, kind of out to select partners right now, is going to open up publicly and anyone can come and build a perfect Rever clone if they wanted to with accounts, with the ad serving technology, with the monetization engine, uh, with uh, the ability to create collections, create sites, all of those tools, every single thing you see at Rever.com is going to be available through our API. We actually built Rever.com uh, on top of our API, which is really, I think, admirable to our, and, and um, you know, a testament of our technology team's ability to actually eat their own dog food. Rarely do you see a company that runs a service actually being wow. built on top of its own API that they're going to make public to everyone. So um, we, we have, a, a, I think, a real open uh, philosophy in this company and a, and a philosophy about respecting creators and about enabling people to do what they want to do with their content. It doesn't have to be you know, labeled Rever. It doesn't have to be branded Rever. Uh, we want everything to be uh, as customizable as possible but still partake in the, in the Rever economy that's being created. We saw what was going on in the marketplace with really what we call user uploaded video versus user created video, original works. And so what we've done is we've implemented a human review process where every single video that is submitted to Rever is uh, reviewed by a human for uh, both adult content and also, and more importantly, copyright infringement, music copyright infringement. We really feel that um, that it's it's kind of the wild west right now. But as economic models move into like Revers that move into online video, um, we just have to maintain a clean network for advertisers and for syndicators that that could get in trouble in the future, especially as the as the kind of crackdowns uh, start happening in regards to video sharing and, and not respecting people's copyright. I think that Rever has really. Um, both started the conversation and really offered a solution for what we consider to be a clean network. Um, because we have a human review process, um, our user-generated content is ensured that it's original works by, by real people, uh, that it's not stolen content just ripped off of television, but also that it's free from uh, pornography or hate speech or anything else that advertisers might find, um, uh, let's just say, unsavory. And so we've gained a lot of the trust of the content community by protecting people's rights, especially their copyrights, but also we've gained a lot of trust of the advertisers. So as advertisers and their clients are interested in user-generated media and interested in embracing social networks, Rever really gives them a flexible yet uh, simple way to get involved and sponsor creators. And really it's kind of a win-win for everyone. When you're advertising on Rever, you're sponsoring creators, you're sponsoring affiliate sites, um, and you're also getting your brand out there to kind of the, you know a, a desirable demographic, if you will, of uh, of online users.